Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showcasing one of the newest features introduced in Power Builder 2025, the ribbon view for menu object. With just a couple of clicks, you can give your application's traditional menus a fresh, modern look using a ribbon style interface, no complex coding required. Here's what we'll cover in this video. Firstly, the key benefits of using ribbon view. Secondly, how to enable Ribbon View in your application. Then, how to customize Ribbon View settings. And finally, a practical demo to show you everything in action. Let's get started. Ribbon View is a new feature introduced in Power Builder 2025 to enhance menu object. It allows you to display classic menus in a modern ribbon style layout with zero coding required. You can enable Ribbon View with a single setting in the MDI frame window. Once enabled, it automatically renders your existing menu in a modern ribbon style layout and even generates a quick access toolbar if one is available. Ribbon View is fully integrated with Power Builder's UI themes and the tab to view feature for MDI windows. This ensures your application has a consistent and visually appealing look across the interface. Activating Ribbon View is as easy as setting the display menu as ribbon bar property in the MDI window. If needed, you can also control this setting programmatically at runtime, giving you flexibility to enable or disable it based on user preferences or application state. Ribbon View is not only easy to enable, it's also easy to customize. Starting in Power Builder 2025, the menu painter includes a new Ribbon View tab in the properties window. This tab allows you to configure how each menu item will appear when rendered in the ribbon style. For example, you can set the panel text to define the label of a ribbon panel and use the panel image to display an icon when the panel is collapsed. These properties apply only to the first item in a submenu or to an item that immediately follows a separator. Each separator in the menu becomes a new panel in the ribbon style interface. If you want to customize individual buttons, you can use the button image property to assign a different icon and the button image size property to control the button size. This gives you precise control over how your menu items appear on the ribbon. Adding new buttons or panels is as simple as adding new menu items. You can also rearrange them by dragging and dropping directly in the menu painter. And for even more flexibility, you can modify these settings at runtime using the menu changed event. This allows your application to adapt the ribbon style layout dynamically based on user actions or conditions. Now let's see ribbon view in action. The project we'll be using in this demo is available on Appion's GitHub page and you can find the link in the video description below. This sample is a traditional MDI style application with a standard menu and toolbar on the main window. Let's modernize its appearance using Ribbon View. To enable Ribbon View, simply check the Display Menu as Ribbon Bar option in the properties of the MDI frame window. That's all you need to do. The feature automatically handles the rendering. This setting can also be controlled at runtime. For example, in this demo, we load the value from an INI file and use it to toggle the display menu as ribbon bar property accordingly. Next, let's enable tab view and reset the UI theme. As you can see, the menu structure and icons are preserved in the ribbon style layout. The ribbon view feature takes care of this automatically. No coding is required. Now let's look at how we can customize the ribbon view. If we open the menu object, we'll see a familiar interface. But starting in Power Builder 2025, you'll notice a new tab in the properties window labeled ribbon view. From this tab, we can define how each menu item appears in the ribbon view. Panel text sets the name of the ribbon panel. Panel image defines the icon that appears when the panel is collapsed. 
These properties apply to the first item in a submenu or the item immediately after a separator. Each separator in the menu creates a new panel in the ribbon. To further customize your ribbon, you can assign a unique icon using the button image property or change the size of a button using the button image size property. Let's update the customer button to appear larger, then we'll run the application again. As you can see, the change is immediately visible. The customer button now appears larger and uses the icon defined in the menu item. This makes it easy to highlight important actions within your interface. Even with minimal customization, Ribbon View gives your application a fresh and modern look. But if you want to go further, this demo includes a dedicated window with examples of common use cases. You can explore those or check the documentation to dive deeper. That concludes our overview of the Ribbon View feature in Power Builder 2025. If you'd like to learn more, you can find links in the video description to the demo project, documentation, and other related resources. Don't forget to like this video if you found it helpful and subscribe to our channel for more Power Builder tips and tricks. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.